Welcome to this 510k tutorial, in which we will demonstrate the features of HATS 4 Days Live 10. HATS 4 Days Live 10 is an analog-inspired 16-step probabilistic sequencer for hi-hats, designed by Alex Kidd for Ableton Max 4 Live, with unique features allowing you to create endless variations on your hats, whilst maintaining full control over your probability parameters, either by writing the sequence through its dedicated controls, or by using the individual randomization possibilities. This sequencer has four sequence lines. A trig line, a probability of play line, probability of open or closed line, and a probability of accent, allowing you to precisely control the sequencer's behavior for each step. The trig line is where the rhythm pattern gets written, and each step increment is set to 16th notes. You can adjust the swing and amount of steps here, and toggle the play direction here between forward, backward, or bi-directional. Prob play allows you to set the probability between 1 and 100% of the step playing a hat. It is by default set to 100%. Prob OC allows you to set the chance the step will trigger either an open or closed hat. At 100% the hat will always be open, and at 0% always closed with values in between controlling the probability of either hat being triggered. The target notes for the closed and open high hats can be set here corresponding to the MIDI value of each sample within your drum rack. They are set to the usual general MIDI mapping by default. Prob Accent controls the probability of the step being accented. Set to 0% that step will play normally, set to 100% the step will definitely be accented. The velocity for an accented note is controlled in VEL high, and each other step will fire using the value set in VEL low, here. At the bottom left of the plugin, you can switch the plugin off and on in real time. When off, the button blinks and the sequencer is still running, but doesn't output any notes. Each of these lines can be reset, or randomized, by pressing the corresponding buttons on the right side of each line. Alternatively, you can use new pattern to randomize the patch. The full reset of all parameters is available at the top right of the plugin. Last but not least, in this update, all parameters are mapped to Ableton's Push 2.